31 items for a hundred dollars. What is going on? <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I'm Chrissy Danielle. Nice to meet you. <laughs> For today's video, I'm going to be doing a Shein haul. I thought this was super crazy because my friend put me on to this Shein website. I knew about it back then when they didn't have much. They literally just like started off with like clothes. And a lot of people think it's a scam, but boo, does this look like a scam to you? Okay, I don't think so. I'm just pulling up everything that I bought because I, I don't know the prices of everything. So I'm going to tell you guys everything that I bought. I bought a lot of stuff. I bought 31 items for $100. This website is so dope. They literally sell stuff for like $2. Literally, I think the most I paid. I bought a swimsuit that was $12, but I think the most that I paid was like 5 Yep, six. Sorry, six dollars. I think we're gonna go down the list and see everything that I bought. Yeah, I'm gonna just go down this list, tell you guys my personal opinion on it. This stuff did come from China. A lot of people are saying that shipments aren't coming. I don't know if shipments are coming, but for me, they came. Um, I am gonna disinfect this stuff once I am done. I was gonna do it before, but I decided there's so there's 31 things. Some of the stuff is like I didn't want to take it all out the packages and then and didn't want to have all the wrappings everywhere and stuff. So I was like, I'm just gonna wait until after I show it and then I'm gonna just put it back in the box and go disinfect it. Just to be safe you know you gotta be safe out here so let's get started so the first item we have multi compartment underwear storage box so I think I bought three but I might have just bought two so here they are oh I did buy three because your girl got a lot of panties this is an underwear storage compartment which I love because my underwear drawer I don't know how many people like actually keep their underwear drawer like organized so I decided to get these and they look pretty good. They have a lot of space. Like, my underwear is not freaking huge. So, all I have to do is roll it up. So, this is enough for... This is five. So, I have enough for 15 pairs of underwear. So, and these were $3 each. So, I paid about $9 total for all of this. Oh, and by the way, I put some hand sanitizer on. Wash my hands. So, yeah, here you go. They're just going to go in my drawer like this. Oh, my goodness. They're cute. They're small. I have two different dresses, right? So, the drawer that I put my underwear in, this would fit perfectly because it's super small. And it's all, like, packed up in there. Usually, like, when I'm doing clothes, I just, like, throw all my underwear in a pile and just pick them up and throw them in there. So, this is very beneficial. I like this a lot. I give this a rating 10 out of 10. Okay, so next is the solid one shoulder, one piece um, swimwear. And this is it. Obviously, I'm not going to put it on. I got it in a large. Oh, yeah. This is cute. Which way is the back? Okay, so it goes like this. This is cute. I like it. it smells a little funny. But I got this for $12. But this is really cute. I like this. I'm definitely going to wear this. I needed a new swimsuit anyways because all my swimsuits are like wore out. So the next item are the Simple Hoop and Stud Earring 6 pairs. Here they are. I got these for $2. I needed some new hoop earrings and they come in gold, silver, and rose gold. And then the same for the stud earrings. So this is what they look like. They're not too big. You know me. The bigger the hoop, the bigger the hole. So next I have the oil bottle with brush. Here it is. I got this for $2. So I like one of these and I've seen it at the gas station because some gas stations you know have like the food area and they were making me a pretzel and they had one of these. It was bigger but they had one of these. They brushed the butter on so I was like oh this is nice and it was only $2. Look comes off easily. It screws back on but you can clearly just pull it off but I'm assuming when it's screwed in it's okay to actually use it. Like you can squeeze it and stuff and it has a little opening. This is nice. I like this. Just if you just want to like brush oil on the bottom you know like like of the pan or like a cookie sheet or anything two dollars y'all so the next thing is the one piece kitchen drain storage basket this was two dollars i'm going to show you guys how beneficial this is hopefully it comes with these little knob things oh yeah okay so it goes on like this this goes right here and then you connect it onto the end of the sink it's a drain so like when you're trying to like drain out fruits or vegetables or anything and you don't want to keep it in the actual sink you could just put it in here two dollars y'all so the next thing is the skull head design glass cup y'all this is so cute this was three dollars and it's just a little cup it's cute has a little skull in it can you see, can you guys see it <laughs> makeup guru <laughs> but this is cute it's like a little skull and you could put like a shot i would use this for shots <laughs> 
who trying to take big shots on their birthday. Me. Like I said, that was $3. I think it's super convenient. So the next thing is the measuring spoon. It's literally like self-explanatory. I just needed some more. And these were $2 is Walmart. That's like 10. Just got some more measuring spoons and I like them. They're plastic. They go down from a fourth of a cup to one cup. And these go from, I'm assuming, one eighth of a teaspoon to one tablespoon. Self-explanatory, like if you cook, if you've seen your parents cook, grandma cook, auntie cook, you know what those are. So the next thing is the stainless steel finger guard. So I got this for a dollar. This is something, see I'm like my sister, if you know my sister, most of you probably don't, but if you know my sister, she loves to get like the craziest stuff for the house period. So this is a finger guard. You put, can you tighten this? Cause my finger, I was about to say my finger's not that big. Basically when you're like cutting fruit or anything or just anything, onions, whatever, you put this this on your finger and then put it at the edge of where you're trying to cut so you don't touch your finger. Y'all, a dollar, come on. I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna see me use this more often. So the next thing is the electric egg beater. So I use, I see people use this for more than just, actually I've never seen anybody use it for beating eggs. <laughs> I've always seen people use it for other stuff. So I just got this, I thought it would be super fun to get. It's a mini hand mixture. So like for little stuff, like if you put, if you put powder into water and you want to mix it up, here you go. Highly doubt it has batteries in it right now. It doesn't even feel like it has batteries. But you turn it on and it twirls. Yeah, I like this. I'm gonna try all this stuff out too. I don't know what kind of batteries this takes, but we're gonna find out. So the next thing is the faucet extender filter. I got this for my faucet, but it's not gonna fit. I didn't realize that my faucet was bigger than like a normal faucet. And my faucet thing already comes out, so like it's huge. So this is not gonna fit, but I'm gonna find somewhere to put it. I might put it like on the bathtub or something. But this is what it looks like. How is it supposed to fit on the damn faucet? I don't know. This just seems super weird. I don't get how like this would fit on a faucet. It's like super tiny. But I did only get this for $2, so I can't like complain. <laughs> I don't really see nothing wrong with it, but you never know. So the next thing is the onion holder slicer. I just seen it and I was like, what did I get this for? I don't even remember. This is next and it was already right here so I'm just gonna show you guys so this is a drain basket okay makes sense so this is what it looks like it's a regular basket but then when you want to drain like anything out of it you pull this up and then you can drain it so then it doesn't you know come out it's like the food that you're cooking and this was five dollars this was actually five but we're gonna go back to this onion holder slicer because I want to show you that. here it is I'm gonna get it so this was two dollars let me organize this real quick so this is an onion holder slicer so you put this in the onion and then you use this to cut you put the knife through here and cut it why is everybody texting me it has this little case to come with it and i think that is just too i just poked myself <laughs> Ooh, it's hard to get this in here but that is too cute i like it a lot this was like i said only two dollars and i think it's gonna be very beneficial when it comes to cutting anything so it's gonna go in the kitchen area okay so next i got some natural 3d thick false eyelashes i got these just as like a tester like i just wanted to see if they were actually gonna be good if i'm gonna wear these it's like very unlikely i mean they might be really good but this is what they look oh these are actually nice but they're huge and my eyes are not that big so i probably have to cut them but this is what they look like they were 150 so they were on sale they used to be two dollars but they were 150. they look pretty nice and they feel fine they feel pretty cool to me so 150 for three sets of eyelashes so next we have the shein makeup brush cleaning silicone pad i needed one of these because my brushes have been getting super dirty and i think that these work so good to clean off your brushes so you know i don't wear makeup like that but i've been trying to get into it more more of like natural like not do the whole thing but just like foundation and stuff so this is gonna work so well i'm definitely gonna use this when we get off of here because this is cute and it has different types of pattern like for bigger brushes smaller you know and this was 150 also they're both 150 oh cool yeah they were both 150 so next is the professional makeup brush 32 piece Woo! i needed some more because i had got these brushes from vanity planet and they have a lot but i needed more because sometimes i'd be wanting to do stuff and they don't have it, like the brush that i need so i got a 32 piece for six dollars if these brushes are good we will find out they look fine to me i have to go through and do one by one these all look fine they look good but do they
they apply good? Do they shed? That's the real question. They look pretty good to me. Whenever I make another makeup video, you will definitely see me using these. And obviously, I will give you guys like a mini review on if they're good or not. This does feel super soft though. I shouldn't be rubbing it on my face without brushing it or washing it. But they are super soft. Some of them, I feel like they're too soft. They might as well give me a brush review because I got 32 pieces. Like, look at all this. They give you even like the old school, like, this is like a makeup sponge, like a mini one. I can use this. Ooh, yeah, because I can use this for my concealer at the bottom. Ooh, sis. This makes me want to do my makeup and I don't even do it. But they have a variety and they're only $6. They're called the Shein Professional Makeup Brush 32 Pieces. So if you guys want them, go ahead and get them. If y'all need some brushes but y'all don't want to spend too much, get these. But I haven't used them yet, so I could be saying get these and then people that do their regular, wow, their makeup on a regular probably won't like them. So it's all up to you. This video is not a promotional video, by the way. I literally just bought all this stuff by myself. My friend told me about the website. She said that she got a pair of earrings for a dollar or something and then like hair clips for like $2. And I was like, I was intentionally going on here to get clothes. I got one piece of clothing. I seen the home stuff and I'm like, I would much rather decorate my house than get clothes because I just ordered $450 worth of clothes at Fashion Nova the other day. So, which that haul will be coming very soon. But I really like these brushes. There's a lot of variety. Literally, they have like, some of them look the same, but they don't work the same. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So that is all of our 32 brushes we'll just put them because i gotta clean all these brushes off i'm cleaning everything off y'all i don't think y'all understand so the next thing is i got a foaming bath ball i have not used one of these in years and i mean years like probably plus five but i was like mm, i should try to use them again i feel like this is so cute i'm like <laughs> But this is super cute. It needs washed, so I'm gonna put this in the washing machine. But this is really cute. I like this a lot, and I I just wanna try something different. The next thing is the wall-mounted toothbrush rack. Mm. Okay, so this is it. It took me a second, but I don't have any. Yeah, I just needed a little push. So this is the wall-mounted toothbrush rack. This was for $3. Did I say what the other stuff was for? Oh, I don't think I said this. This was for $3 too, sorry. But this is also $3, the wall-mounted toothbrush rack. So this is what it looks like. You stick this part to the wall. You put it on here like this, and it holds your toothbrushes and stuff. That's cute. Is it gonna really work? Who knows? This was only $3, so I don't know why I'm trying to put it together because I'm about to wash it. Okay, so the next thing I got was the one-piece artificial, artificial hanging vine. They make it look so much bigger on the website this was only three dollars so this is what it looks like it's just one vine i am gonna wash this i'd rather wash it anyways in like hot water so that it can all just drape because now it just looks like it was rolled up this is cute but like what am i gonna do with it we'll find something obviously it's fake so the next thing was the she and cute slogan print mirror sticker so i'm not gonna open it yet because i want to put it up somewhere but it is pink and it says on it hold on i'm gonna tell you guys what it says i'll put a picture up too it says "Ooh, you look amazing no it doesn't this is the wrong thing i have a different one did they not say this to me here it is so it says "Ooh, you look amazing i'm probably gonna put this either on the mirror downstairs in the bathroom or up here i don't know but this is super cute and i feel like it's so motivational so I'm gonna just put this in the downstairs pile for now. It's getting a little crowded. So next is the four grid pencil holder. I got this because I don't like my pencils and pens and stuff sitting on my desk. And I have this little shelf thing on top of my computer. And I thought this would fit perfectly in it. Hopefully it does. And then I could put all my pens and stuff in here so I don't have to keep it on the table on the desk oh and this was oh, i didn't tell you guys what this was this mirror thing was two dollars and then this was three dollars let's go stay in here so the next thing i got is the 36 piece ball bub tree bub 36 piece ball bulb tree shaped night light i got this for 14 dollars. i did not know that i spent that much on this but i guess okay cool i was gonna say i have zero faith in how this is about to look right now because it's in like this flat surface box this is cute. If you guys want my honest opinion, let me look at the picture before I start talking. On the picture, it doesn't really look like this. This looks like something I could have made and I'm dead ass. Obviously you pull these apart so it looks like a tree, but girl. <laughs> they literally wrapped this with tape. If somebody asks me where I got this from, I'm just gonna tell them that I made this shit at this point. Cause that's exactly what it looks like. It is cute though, like I'm gonna give them their credit, it's cute. But it's definitely not what I expected. And then you spread these apart.
All right, so this is what it looks like. This is actually cute, okay? I'm gonna give them that. It's actually cute. I don't get why it needs batteries. If you plug it in, you might as well just have just batteries or plug it in. But it's so cute. This is gonna go in my office on my desk. So the next thing is the slogan print mirror sticker. This is what I was talking about. This was $2 and it actually looks like a decent size. So it says, you are so cool and intelligent and strong and fierce. I think this is cute. So this is most likely gonna go in the bathroom downstairs. I don't know where I'm gonna put this, honestly. I might keep it in my office, who knows? But I'm gonna put a picture on the screen of what it looks like too, cause I can't show you, but this is super cute. Next we have the three piece simple toothpaste squeezer. So they give you three different sizes and I'm happy because when I ordered it, I thought they were gonna only give me one. This was $2. Put it on your toothpaste when it gets to a point where it's empty and it squeezes it out. I think that is so tight. How the hell do you open this shit though? How do you open this? This shit is like plastic. <laughs> okay, how the hell are you supposed to open this? But I guess so. But still, I think it'd be nice. So I got it. It was $2. So the next thing is the soap dish holder. I got this from my shower. And I think this is going to be so convenient because I have like the little cheap ones from like Walmart or something. And it's always slipping and falling on the ground. This would be perfect for my soap. You put this on the back. You put your soap. That is so cute. I like this a lot. I'm going to put all this stuff up today. So the next thing is the Doralilla. The abstract face print tapestry, this was $9. See, I thought I always spent like two to three dollars on most stuff. This is what it is. I'm not gonna take it out. I'm just gonna show you guys a picture of it. Like I said, it was $9. This is actually gonna go where this is right now, but I'm planning, I'm planning on like remodeling my office, so I'm not gonna put it up yet. It's high paint. So the next thing is the Shein tassel curtain tie bags, two pieces. I got these for $2, so basically a dollar each. For now, I'll probably put it on my actual curtains, but I have two windows above me. Like, they're really small windows, and I wanna get, like, curtains for those windows, and I wanna tie them against that. But this is cute, look at it. Baby, look, this is what I was talking about, to tie the curtains together with. Oh, okay. Ain't that cute? Yeah. So, yeah, you just tie it around the curtain for whenever you, I don't know. But it's cute, I like it. And it, like I said, it was only $2, so it's basically a dollar each. The next thing is the random wall-mounted mop holder. They're bogus. They did not tell me, oh they did. It says one piece. <laughs> oh, I only got one, but it's okay because I only have one mop. This was a dollar, which if you get this from like Walmart or something, it's like 10. We don't know how effective this is yet. <laughs> we don't know if it's really gonna work, but you put the back on here like this, boom, and then put it on the wall. Don't think it's gonna stick, but that's just me. So the next thing I got was the medicine storage box. It's so tiny, okay? I did not think it was gonna be this tiny. But I'm glad that I have one because I've been trying to take my vitamins consistently. And I feel like this would help. So it goes from Sunday to Saturday, obviously. And I think it'll fit all my stuff. This is cute though. I like it. I feel like it's too small. I'm Maybe because I'm used to seeing bigger ones. But this is still cute. One thing left out of all these 36. I got 31 items, bro. That's crazy. The next thing is the 2M, I don't know what that means, artificial leaf vine. So this is $2. I'm actually gonna put this above my desk. That's what we're gonna do. This is what it looks like. Um, I don't really feel like I'm doing this all right now. Oh, there it goes. So yeah, this is cute. I'm just gonna hang it up. I'm gonna let it like drape on something for like a day. It smells like fish. This smells like the fish, like the deli section, like where the fish and should be. <laughs> like where the crab be and shit. I swear to God, it smells like fish. They must have got this from a pond. This is what it looks like. It's pretty long, actually. I like it. It's long enough and I'm not trying to break it. So we're just gonna put this right here. So that was it guys. Total, like I know I say 100, but total, total, I spent 107, 31 items. I think hopefully I'm gonna like all these items. Some of this stuff is like organizing stuff. So I'm excited to organize whatever I have to organize. And yeah, that's it. So that's it for this video guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up and make sure that you follow all my social media. It's gonna be on the screen and I will see you guys in this video.